This is Nick with Firewalls.com, and today I'm going to be showing you how to create a source net on your Sonic Wall firewall. So once we're in the management section, we're going to go into our address objects to ensure that we have a address object configured for where the mail for this example will be coming from. Basically, wherever you want your source on your source net. Um, so I created this in a previous video, which I will leave a link to in the description, but this is where my mail server is. The next thing that we're going to do is create a quick service group, just with the services that we want translated, or that we want to be looking for. So we're going to use POP3. There we are. And SMTP. Okay, now that we've got that added, we're ready to create our source NAT. So we're going to go into our NAT policies and click Add. We'll just name it Email Services NAT. So our source is going to be that email server. That is where uh, this is going to be coming from. And we're going to translate that into looking like it's coming from our public IP. So I'm going to set that to our WAN interface, which is currently X1. Now we don't want to translate any destinations here because this is a source net. So we're going to keep that at, as any and original so that will not be taking any effect, but however, we do want to change our service. So we're going to set that to be our email services group that we created earlier, and keep that as original. So this won't translate anything, but it does tell the rule what kind of protocols it's looking for, in this example, SMTP and POP3. You can get pretty granular and choose which interfaces you want these um, rules to be working on, but we're going to leave that alone for today, as we don't need it. Make sure that you keep this enabled, this this little check um, box, you know, checked. Otherwise, it will come in disabled by default. And that's really all you need for setting up a NAT policy. So make sure that you like and subscribe. And thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.